Hey there, I'm gonna show you how to build a WordPress website in 15 minutes or less. If you're looking to scale your online business and get into the website development world, um, this is a great tutorial and it'll show you the exact steps that you need to take to get your website off the ground in 15 minutes or less. So let's jump into it. The first thing that you're gonna need is a hosting provider. We highly recommend Flywheel. The reason is, is it scales super easily with your business. It allows for a ton of storage, bandwidth, great CDN, um, free SSL, and a great dev environment to actually build out your WordPress website. As we mentioned, as you scale, if you want to add more subdomains, etc., all of that can happen within one Flywheel account. So it's a great asset for, for scalability. So once you've gotten started with your Flywheel account, let's just jump into the create a site. Um, you'll just click up here, add new site. Um, you'll enter in your credentials for what you want you, your site to be named. So in this case, I'm on our website and I'm just going to do this for you guys so that you actually see how quick it is. Okay, so your site will take just a minute. In the meantime, while your site's loading, we recommend using the WP Astra template. Um, this says brainstorm, but if you just type in wpastra.com, WP Astra is by far the, the fastest, most lightweight, and probably feature intensive um, themes and, and template out there. Uh, it's, it's great for any company looking to scale their online business while also having premium features on top of it. Want to say it's 169 bucks um, for the year. So it's a, it's a great, uh, great asset. As you'll see here, I downloaded all these, so they should be ready to go um, as soon as this website gets done. So while your website is getting created in the flywheel dashboard, we recommend going over to WP Astra and downloading this as your theme. It is by far the fastest and most lightweight WordPress theme on the market. It's not just their tagline, it's true. We've tested it across a variety of different websites. We have over 60 clients that we're actively working with today that utilize Word this as their WordPress theme. So once you've downloaded it, you're gonna jump back into your flywheel dashboard. You're gonna click WP Admin. WP Admin is going to take you right into your admin dashboard. From here, you're going to upload the Astra file that you just downloaded, and you're gonna hit Install Now. Once WP Astra is installed in your WordPress account as your primary theme, you are going to then want to create a child theme. The child theme can just be created within the WP Astra account. Let me show you exactly how to do that. When you log into your WP Astra account, you're gonna see under downloads Astra child theme. You click Astra child theme, and then you're gonna be brought to a page where you can actually name your, your child theme. We've already done that here for the sake of this video. And so once again, this theme is uploaded, we're going to activate it. Again, this is just the parent WP Astra theme. And then we're going to add the new child theme. Remember, all of your edits should be made, um, should be made in your child theme. So that is how WordPress works. You don't wanna edit the parent theme, you wanna edit the child theme. So we will upload this child theme and then set that as our active theme. The reason is, is we, want, we don't wanna change any of the presets within WP Astra. Okay, now it's time to um, download the plugins that we have here. So the first plugin we recommend downloading is the Astra Premium Template. We're going to install that. The reason is, is this is where our site is going to, to first be created. We're going to activate that. And then we're actually going to add Elementor. And these are really the two primary plugins that you need to get your site off the ground. In future videos, we'll talk about the SEO softwares that we use and any additional add-ons like Gravity Forms, um, you know, like we said, Yoast SEO, Ultimate Elementor add-ons, etc. But for the sake of just getting your website up, these are really the only two plugins that you're going to need today. Premium starter templates will download any additional uh, plugins that you need 
associated with that template that you're selecting. All right, so now that those two plugins are downloaded, you're just gonna want to go to plugins. From plugins, just under premium starter templates, see library. This will then bring you through the setup process on how to create this website. So we'll scroll down, we'll click build your website now. Again, we are using Elementor for the sake of this tutorial. And we're just gonna start out with the basic love nature template. If you have a logo that you would like to use, you can upload it here, or again, we can upload it later. So we're actually just going to skip this and continue and use their logo. This is where your logo will auto populate across the entire website so you never have to change it. We're going to use their default colors. If you wanna use other colors, go ahead. Basically the colors that will change are some of your subtext, your call to actions, and your buttons. Again, call to actions, buttons, and same thing. Um, but just to clarify that. So once you've selected the color as well as the font, again, you can change font for title, paragraph, etc. You're going to hit continue. You don't need to fill any of this out. Um, you know, this is obviously just subject if you want to receive um, stuff from them. So we're going to go submit and build website. And now our website is going to be auto generated in the background. Again, it's going to look exactly like that, that template that we just saw. Once this template is downloaded and ready to go, we can add additional features if we so wish. But again, this is going to import all of the additional plugins that we need, such as form plugins or any other plugin that um, makes the site run. So here we have it. In five minutes, we five to 10 minutes, we've created this beautiful website that, that functions well that you can render across all devices and uh, it's searchable as well. So now you can jump in here, populate images where you wish to include images and uh, edit each individual page with edit with Elementor.